With the holidays looming, why not give a gift that keeps on giving? At Bazaar Brazil in Redwood City, Blanche Shaheen found gifts that not only help the environment, but help impoverished communities as well. All this, this product come from Brazil and I work with a handmade product in environmental friend and fair trade. And this is nice because all these uh, things come from poor areas in the country but they have traditional doing something. They receive 100% of they want, okay, because I bought and I paid and it's not consignment, it's not, not this. They receive the money, and if I will sell, I will sell. If I want, this is my risk. I'm doing the business, and they are artists. These bowls here and the plates on the wall, they are made by recycled cardboard and banana tree fiber. Mm -hmm. This is from Minas Gerais. These people here, they, they grow bananas, and they use the fiber. When you grow banana, you harvest, you need to cut the tree because the bananas come back again, mm -hmm. and uh, they use the fiber. Look at that. It's amazing. It's, yeah. It's yeah. sturdy, too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this uh, pendulous, made by crochet, uh, this is a project in the north of the country. They work with girls and women. They, are, they come from poor families and uh, they live in that fine line to be a prostitute. And this project here takes them from the streets. They go in the school in the morning. In the afternoon, they do this. They, the, the, they learn how to do crochet and they make this here. I feel emotion when I saw because you see the faces of the girls doing the thing and uh, they have uh, an opportunity to, to go in a new direction and have a decent life. I have these uh, rugs and pillows. They are made by waste. Uh, polyester is a waste from the factory. When they do the polyester, they have waste and these people use all the waste. This is one artist from... Londrina, and she uses used coffee filter as canvas. You can see here. This is a used coffee filter. Yes, used <laughs> coffee filter. And she does the deco coffee decoration. This is astounding. Honestly, I've never seen anything like and this before. And did you see? I have a lot of things here, could be garbage, and became art. And I have one purse here. It's made by uh, latex from the tree and looks like uh, leather, but is veg we call vegetable leather. This way they are, they are protecting the area and uh, pro uh, helping the people who works with the Siringueira is the rubber tree because they scrape the, the, the Siringueira and take the, the latex to make the rubber and it's a huge process. They come here and they say, Oh my God, this is so fun. This is so colorful. Play as yes, is so fun. And some people come here and say, are you high? But no, not yet. <laughs> <laughs> I love her. Oh, She's awesome. Yeah. Great, great, great stuff. Well, Blanche Heen joins us now with more items from Bazaar Brazil. I got yeah. so caught up in the piece, I forgot to reintroduce you. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> Isn't she charming? She yes, is. she is. Yeah. I mean, she's a journalist. By, before she opened up her shop, she was a journalist in Brazil, and she found all of these rural communities, yeah. and she oh. wanted to help them in some way, and so she does with this Fantastic. shop. You got so you saw that vegetable leather they were yeah. working? Yeah. Yeah. Feel it. This is a bag made Ooh. with it, and it's soft. It's just like leather, isn't oh, yeah. it? Yeah. Really nice. It's like really it. fascinating. Really I found nice. a lot of little things where, okay. honestly, these are gifts that keep on giving. These are gifts that help rural communities, like this towel. Okay. Take a look at this kitchen towel. That's they actually cute. sell this towel at Anthropology oh. too. This towel is made by Cooperative of 300 women. This is actually a flower sack, and huh. they add this crochet, this detail. Look it's really cute, like a it's watermelon, really grapes, That's perfect okay. for a kitchen. Okay. These dolls, here's a little family here. Uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> These dolls are I made by people between the ages of 16 and 72 
men included, that make these dolls and they sustain their communities by making 500 dolls a month. <laughs> you can play. Now, remember last week when I had you drink the acai berry juice? Yes. Yeah. And Janelle wasn't too thrilled with it, but yeah. you well, didn't mind. No, it wasn't I, I like bad. It. <laughs> it just you just was didn't love thick. it, right? Okay. Well, they make jewelry with Look these berries this. and wow. they dye yes. them with natural dyes. And even the center <laughs> looks like there's a jewel. Try it on, Janelle. It looks really Ooh. nice on you. It'll go on. You'll, you'll get it. There you go. Yes. Isn't that nice? Wow. Love that. <laughs> Excellent. Now, this is made out of dough, but it looks like a jewel, but it's made out of dough that they can, you know, they meld and that they just wow. make this beautiful looking piece with it. That's cool. And last but not least, I have this flower. <gasps> Oh, That's this is pretty. lovely. They make this from leaves of a bush. This is like a napkin holder? Really? Napkin it's a napkin, napkin holder, napkin yes. Yeah. It's a napkin it's holder. It's a bush flower. Yeah, and she, <laughs> it's a bush flower. And she That's has really a huge cool. plaque in her store that's filled with these flowers if you want to use it as a wall, you know, for your wall. Sure. It could be a wall, wall flower. Wall flower, <laughs> exactly. Wall flower. Those are some neat some ideas. Neat some great yeah. holiday gift ideas exactly. for sure. Exactly. And it helps these communities. Yeah. Environmentally exactly. friendly and helpful to impoverished people. That's fantastic. The gift Lush. that keeps on giving. Yeah. Win win situation. Yes, yeah. thank you so much for <laughs> introducing us to the stuff. Thank really you guys. Cool. You want to well, keep the bracelet? <laughs> yeah. Maybe. And well, you want to buy your children, besides these items, some of the hottest toys this holiday season. We'll show you how to get a hold of some must haves. That's next. And on Monday, you can prepare the ultimate Thanksgiving dinner from mood to food. House Dr. Lisa Quinn and celebrity chef Guy Fieri team up to show you how.